all who listen to this happy pod, welcome. My name is Noah Parker, and this is My World of Wonder, bringing you your touch of Disney magic every week. Today, I am joined by my lovely sister, Marcy. Hello. Which means, like I've said probably in the last five episodes. <laughs> <laughs> every episode. <laughs> yeah, it, it can mean only one thing. It must be time for us to talk about our next Disney Channel original movie. Yes. Um, if you listened to the podcast last week and you did your homework, hopefully you're prepared and you have watched it. Um, so you can just sit back and enjoy the discussion. Uh, if not, then... Um, Good luck. <laughs> Good <laughs> Feel luck free to watch it on. afterwards. Definitely spoilers if you haven't watched it already. Um, but yeah, um, with that being said, we're going to dive straight in to the summary that Marcy has prepared and I have not pre-read. <laughs> and I'm sorry if it's bad. <laughs> <laughs> so take it away, Marcy. All right. When 13-year-old Johnny is forced to leave his beloved home in Hawaii for his father's job, he is met with new chilling challenges as he navigates the snow, a new school, and bringing peace to the slopes. That was fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. I can write when I want to. That was great. I Thank really, you. I really like the new chilling challenges. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and then brings peace to the slopes. I love it. I yeah. love it. That was fantastic. You, you. Were, she was worried. She was like, "Are you sure you don't want to read it first? <laughs> and I'm like, "I'm it. gonna just trust you with this one. Dude. Let's go. Let's see what happens." Cool. I think it was a. Uh, I think it was a good call. Yes. Um, Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, that being said, um, it is time for cast and crew. Mm -hmm. um, actually, I forgot to do something important. And that was um, add the, I think normally I have the writers up here, don't I? Above the cast and crew. No, you, no. Have, you have them after. I, th I definitely have the release date up top. The release date, And yes. I don't this time, but I am 99% sure it was 1999. Yes. Yeah. Which I think is the second one now. That was released in 1999. Because, mm -hmm. yeah, Smart House was also released Smart in 1999. Smart House was also 99, yeah. Um, the 13th year was also 1999. Mm -hmm. So the last three have all been 99. Mm -hmm. um, hopefully we'll get out of 99 ne uh, next, <laughs> <laughs> next month. Next month. But um, I will let you kick off with uh, the, the, uh, the cast. cast list here. All right. So starting off, we have um, Brandon Baker playing Johnny Kapahala. Uh, Lee Thomas Young played Sam Sterling. Then we have Carrie Hiroyuki Tagawa playing Johnny Tsunami. Well pronounced. Thank I you. let Marcy pronounce them because <laughs> you looked it up and I did not. I was scared <laughs> to butcher it. Uh, yeah. Mary Page Keller played May. Uh, sorry. Melanie. Melanie. Sorry. My, I should have yeah, worn my glasses for this Johnny's part. Johnny's mom. Yeah. Melanie is Johnny's mom. Uh, Johnny Tsunami is indeed mm -hmm. Johnny's grandfather. Yes. Um, yes. And then we have Yuji Okumoto playing Pete, Johnny's father. Kirsten Storms, or as I call her, <laughs> Xenon, Xenon. Uh, played Emily. Um, I'm going to get to that, but um, put, we'll put a pin in that pin one in that real one. quick because we're just going to do one yeah. more, I think. Two more. Two more? Yeah. Oh, yes. Um, we have Zachary Bostorm, Bostrom. Bostrom. I was doing so good on pronunciation. Sorry. Uh, Zachary Bostrom. Bostrom. One of the two. One of the two. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, he played Brett. This movie's big bad. Mm -hmm. It's just really annoying more than bad, but... <laughs> yeah. And then yeah. I did not read this name ahead of time, and I should have, but... Um, I think it's... Silic? Silk? I think it's Silk. Silk? Silk Cozart, Cozart. played Sergeant Sterling, who is Sam's dad, mm -hmm. who was, according to his insignia, and they maybe said it and I missed it, a first sergeant in the United States Marine Corps. Oh, I didn't fact check any of the other ribbons, but I'm glad you know those though. Yeah, that you I, can just, I know like, all look I know all the ranks. So yeah. that I was like, I didn't know if they said it, but late there is a. I don't yeah. think I wrote it down, but there is a point. Yeah. When in the future something happens with Sam's mm -hmm. family, and he mentions and he that mentions his dad's it. getting promoted to sergeant yes. major, which yes. is accurate, it would be the next okay. promotion. Yeah. Fun stuff. Yeah. I didn't I didn't check any of his insignia <laughs> or anything like any yeah. of his ribbons or anything like that because yeah. I, I don't know they, they're. I don't know enough about <laughs> about their insignia to know. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so we're dropping down now to our cast and crew, who I like to give shout outs to. They don't get enough praise, I feel like, yeah. in, in the movies. So um, the story and the film, I guess, was written by Anne Austin and Douglas uh, Sloan. Mm -hmm. It was directed by Steve Boyum. It was cinemagraphed <laughs> by <laughs> David Hennings. Edited by Craig Bassett. Which sounds familiar. It does sound familiar, and I don't know why. Like, uh, we haven't been... I think Smart House... We said Smart House and 13th Year were the only other two that I did that with. Yeah. So, and I don't think either of them 
have the same editor. Yeah. Mm -mm. So I don't know why that sounds familiar, but it does. Craig Bassett sounds familiar. So maybe I'll look into that afterwards. I wonder if it's like one of the actors has the same last name and that's why it sounds... Maybe. That's probably it. Probably. We'll look through. We'll let you guys know in the comments. <laughs> but yeah, I do want to put out some shout outs. Like some of the cinematography, there's mm-hmm. a couple of moments that were so good. Like there's a lot of moments that are good. There's but a lot of moments. There was a moment that I was like, whoa. Yeah. And it comes down to cutting and also mm-hmm. just the cinematography. Yeah. The way that, that Mr. Higgins, Hennings, sorry, <laughs> Higgins, <laughs> the way that Mr. Hennings um, shot a particular sequence absolutely blew my mind. Mm-hmm. And it makes me want to become a cinematographer is that <laughs> later on in the notes that you'll talk it is, about yes it? Okay. we'll get to okay. it um with that being said later on in the notes um <laughs> we are trying to keep this one short and not mm. recite the film <laughs> not scene by scene, scene by line scene. by line yeah um but there are we are there are like a couple things in each scene that i do want to kind of briefly talk For about sure, but, yeah um yeah so without any further ado let's <laughs> dive dive on in shall let's, we Jump on um, the first thing is like as soon as it opens, mm-hmm. right? They're watching the tape of his grandfather. Yes. And then you kind of get pulled out from the TV and you realize mm-hmm. they're watching a video and yeah. it's not happening. Yeah. Or was it? I was getting confused no. with the back and forth. So his, <laughs> gran- his grandfather was his surfing. His grandfather was surfing, but they were also but they were um, also watching, watching the, film. the film. But they were also reading or looking through the yeah. Yeah. There was a lot of yeah. back and forth that got a little forth. confusing. Yeah. But it was still cool. Yeah. And then the first thing that I noticed was, so, um, um, Brandon Baker, his Hawaiian slang felt natural and it was cool. Mm -hmm. But the other two guys, like was, who was it? Um, Um, I don't remember the other guy's names. Um, Jake and Jake and yeah. Cause it's Jakey and whatever the other guy was, but that's what he called him. But whatever the other two guys, Mm -hmm. I was like, y'all feel like you are forcing so hard. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) Like y'all were definitely not raised here. You were actors who were hired to say these lines and it was kind of obvious and it kind of hurt a little bit, but it was fine. Yeah. It was the effort Uh that mattered. Right. (laughs) Yeah. Um, so that was fun. Yeah. That was good. And Um, then I like how he's like, he's telling the story of how he got, how his grandpa got the nickname Johnny Tsunami. Yeah. And he's like, his grandpa comes over and he's like, Oh, you just love looking at all that old stuff. So good. And he's like, can I show him the medal? Right. (laughs) And he's like, yeah, you know where it's at. Like he is like his pride and joy. And like, I love how Johnny's like so proud of his grandpa for it. Right. It's so cool. It's so cool. Um, and then it was one. Okay. So like, so like they have the surfing contest and his dad mm-hmm. doesn't show up, mm-hmm. right? And like also his mom and grandpa got there like right at the end, <laughs> <laughs> right? They they got there according to what the the guy in the stand was saying. Mm-hmm. They got there about thirty seconds about before 30 his seconds run was before over. The run. Yeah, before the whole competition. Because it was took over. about ten seconds to talk to the guy, and then yeah. he's like, he's got ten sec, he got twenty, 20 seconds, seconds to catch this wave yeah. <laughs> and get yeah. a ten point score. Yeah, and I was like, mm, <laughs> y'all are just as bad as dad, low key. Low key, yeah. Unless he only has a minute to begin with, <laughs> I, I guess. Mean, well, maybe he maybe. does, but I feel like a minute's not enough to catch a swell and get in and go back out. Right. Because he was at the end of a swell after. Yeah. The, before yeah. they did this. So, I don't know. It was yeah. weird, but yeah. anyway. So, he gets home and he kind of like, he's like, hey, dad. Mm-hmm. I wish you were there, but apparently you hate me. <laughs> it's like, sorry, you missed my competition. Right. Again. <laughs> and it was literally like, I'm like, okay, I've, we've watched, was this the fifth one? The yeah. fifth decom we've watched yeah. now? And I'm like, I know exactly where this is going. There's going to be There's gonna a heart be... <laughs> to heart. <laughs> uh, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, but I will say that the movie did throw me a couple of curveballs I wasn't expecting. Yeah. I, I will also kind of pause here to say this was the first decom that we watched that I wasn't like instantly recalling really? what was going to happen next. Well, I was, I was like, I kind of, I know like the overall story, yeah. but like every scene I was like, Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, but it wasn't until yeah. it was happening. Like yeah. with smart house, it was like the opening sequence. And I was like, like, I could probably I got, stop this and, and start the podcast. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. But with I this one, I was like, this, I need yeah. to watch this. Like, intently all the way through like i i didn't even yeah if i like normally if i'm watching one of these mm-hmm. i'll get up and use the restroom and come back and like still know what's happening yeah and yeah. not really miss anything but mm-hmm. for this one i was like if i have to get up to use the restroom i have to pause it really yeah and it was That's weird but anyway yeah. um i didn't like how his dad was like ah oh, let's see how much money surfers make yeah that was because 
That was a D bag move, to be honest. Yeah. It's kind of. And he's like, very subtle, Dad. Yeah. Ignore like... this note here. <laughs> I'm gonna delete that one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, don't mind me. Um, but yeah, so I, so Dad's working really hard yeah. on the internet. Well, it's, yeah, that's what he's, he's doing. <laughs> I can't remember what it's called, but he, study he does net coding or something like and that. stuff. He's yeah, called, I think it's called study net. Something like that. Yeah. Something similar. Yeah, and this is like when the internet's new, <laughs> too. But it wasn't really new, like. <laughs> but like it's. It was new to like general like, public, yeah, I guess. Like yeah. newer. Like Johnny had a laptop. Right. But it was like a big break. Yeah, that's <laughs> you know? true. So it was like. His computer was smaller than uh, than uh Ben's was in Smart House. So true. <laughs> that's true. But anyway. Yeah. So and then okay, th- so then they're like. His dad yeah. basically has to, they, so they're starting this program so they can share files between schools mm-hmm. and everyone can study off the same material, which is yep. literally just the internet now. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. Google. Yeah. It's Google. <laughs> but. Wikipedia. But it's, what's weird is like, he's like, they're trying to get it off the ground and then they mm-hmm. finally get someone to bite who's like, yeah, let's try it let's out. Let's try it out. Yeah. And so they request that they come and install it. Mm-hmm. And how much time did they, well, I'm sure. Okay. I swear. His dad knew. His dad had to have known like oh, months in advance. He had to have known months, at least six months at the the very minimum. That's what I'm saying. And like, right? yeah. how much time did they give Johnny to prepare for this? They gave him one week. One week. He's like, we need to talk. Oh, he's like, what's, he's like, oh, I want to go surfing. And they're like, no, we need to talk about this. Uh, we got it. This, this thing is all picked up and. And I have to go install it. And he's like, oh, how long are you going to be gone? And he's like, well, we're moving. <laughs> and he's like, Johnny's like, what? <laughs> yeah. It was like, what the heck? Like, like, you literally oh, tell oh, your kid. Oh, right. You have, it's like, uh, in a week, your whole life's going to change, yeah. by the way. <laughs> he's like, when do, we, when do we move? And he's like, we leave in a week. Everything's all set up. We got a house. We got a car. And I'm like, that had to have taken you at least Honestly, six months. And I'm like, it, I'm three like, months this, to this, do that. This, you, you got, to get the house. When you're moving. Yeah. Especially across the country or the from an world, island to the country. Almost. Halfway around the world is what they say. Right. I don't know if that's accurate, but the kid would have to pack his stuff. Yeah. With with more than a week notice. More than a week notice. Yeah. Right. Yeah. He didn't have anything packed. So did they start like he just had clothes. packing his clothes and just putting them in boxes and sticking them in the garage and like, well, They're he like, never wears this one anyway. We'll see how long it takes him to notice. He's all the time. It's fine. He's right? surfing all the time. They it's just fine. slowly take a picture off of his wall every day <laughs> to <laughs> see if he notices. Yeah. And then once they say it's one week, then it's just basically peeling yeah. off the paper and <laughs> yeah. fold it up and you're good to go. <laughs> I thought prob- that was dumb. They probably had like a moving company come in too. But yeah, but I feel like but... still you still have to pack your stuff up. Yeah. Like they don't pack Unless... your boxes. Unless you pay them a lot, which I guess maybe, maybe it's maybe. companies paying for it and they yeah. have a ton of money to do it. But yeah. um, anyway, we need to move on from that. Moving point. on. Yep. <laughs> so no. then he goes to this new school in Vermont and it's a private school. Yes. And Vermont. the first thing I saw in this new school, other than the guy who's the jerk. obligatory <laughs> jerk of yeah. the Disney movie was, I was literally like, oh my God, it's Xenon. It's Xenon. <laughs> it's I forgot Xenon. it was her because she has... Well, I guess she has bangs in Xenon. She looked almost exactly the same, except, except she was she... wearing clothes from the 90s and not from... I think that's what threw me off. 2025 <laughs> or whatever. The... Is that... Tw- what is it? 2125. 20... What year is... The... No, 2160 something. Yeah. Yeah. It was like... Because like in the, in the little... Uh, what's it called? The thumbnail... Um, when I was like p- first pulled up the video, the movie to watch it, yeah. it's her in like her black, um, snow outfit right? and sunglasses. And I was like, oh, who is that actress? I can't tell who it is. <laughs> and then like, I turned on the movie and it got to that part and I was like, it's Xenon. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Okay. Yeah. So, but I'm like, this is definitely why I had a crush on Kirsten Storm. Oh yeah. Cause she was in like everything. <laughs> because Xenon and Don, 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 well, Johnny Tsunami was out or sorry. I'm getting turned around. Mm-hmm. Xenon was out when I was born. Yeah. I think I was born with it. Yeah. <laughs> Which I'm realizing, yeah. you know, as an infant, having a crush on a, what, with then 14 the, yeah. year old was a little irrational. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> it's okay. I'm over it yeah. now. But anyway, but like we, we really grew up on these movies anyway, but it's, yeah. so it's like these movies were always shown close mm-hmm. together on Disney channel. Yeah. So I'm like, this must be why I had a, such a huge crush on Kirsten Storm. Because every other movie I saw had her in it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So that was that was funny. That was fun. Um, um, 
Yeah, and and then I'm not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip that one out too. Yeah, we delete that. No, it's kind of dumb. <laughs> it was a stupid joke. I don't think it's worth worth anything. Yeah. But so they're in the classroom, and then Brett is like, or after after class, Brett's like, "What a loser!" Yeah, and I'm like, like, "Why is he a loser? Because he's not from there, right? What? Like this guy's just they instantly say that Johnny's a loser." For literally no reason, for, for just except that he's the only one not wearing kid. a uniform because yeah. it's his first day and they didn't give it to him yet. Like, yeah. that's not his fault. Yeah. Oh, that was so dumb. Yeah. <laughs> <That> was, <laughs> but I'm like, I'm like, why is he a loser? Like, why, just, why are they just it's just because like, he's new. A loser. He's new and now, and Brett is the bully. So yeah. See now, if you guys him. listening to the podcast were looking at me and being like, "Wow, what a loser!" I'd be like, <laughs> "Hey, <laughs> you <laughs> caught me. You. <laughs> caught you. me red-handed." <laughs> but Johnny, they haven't known him long enough to have a to to, yeah. to say that so i'm like, I'm like that's messed up and then he's got that magazine with all the mm-hmm. surfers and stuff yeah and he's like all the girls look like this yeah yeah pretty much pretty much <laughs> you can just borrow it and give it back to me when you're done and i'm like, like y'all are trading off dirty magazines here <laughs> like what the heck that this I'm is like, a kid's movie you're 13 disney this is a private school that's why it's a private school <laughs> <laughs> mm, indeed can i just note it's yeah. called skyline academy <laughs> yes and there's a school. My ears perked here. up a couple of times <laughs> yeah. because when they say Skyline Academy, it didn't. I didn't right. think twice. But, when but they just she's. Said I think Skyline. Emily at one point says Skyline, and I was like, "Wait yeah. a second, because there's yeah. a school, there's a school, there's real a high close school. to where yeah. I live, called Skyline. Called Skyline, yeah. Skyline High School. Well, our our brothers went to that school. Yes, our brothers so. did go to that school part time. Yeah. Andrew, who you haven't seen yet on the podcast, you might never see it because might not ever see. If, it. if well, me and Andrew talked about it. <laughs> And I'm like, honestly, like, he's like, honestly, I feel like if I was a guest in your podcast, keeping it family rated like we do, keeping it PG, would you would have difficult. 35 seconds of usable footage. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, honestly, you're probably right. Yeah, for Andrew. Yeah. We might create a special podcast just for him. That's a yeah. little bit more risque, but it's yeah. not going to be this one. <laughs> um. So then we find out that they all go skiing. Like that's their thing. Like every ski. freaking day. <laughs> yeah. Like how Johnny goes surfing every day they go skiing every day i see it sounds less weird when you say it like that yeah but, but what's weird is that as a native colorado and i've never been skiing i've never before. been skiing i've never been snowboarding i've been in the mountains i've barely i've sledded but i guess sledded it i've gone sledding i've never been <laughs> tubing but that scares me because i don't know ah, that'd be a fun way to go though <laughs> be a fun way to go <laughs> but anyway, anyway so <laughs> they end up um Brett's like, hey, uh, hey, Hawaii, have you ever, you've, you've gone skiing before, right? And he's like, uh, yeah, because he just wants to fit in. They call right. him a loser. He feels bad. He's like, oh, yeah, I've gone a couple times. Like, I'm not an expert, but I've gone a couple times. <laughs> and they're like, The way well, he answered that question should have been definitely no. like, yeah. Well, I think, th- I think, I think Brett was knew. like, yeah, you definitely yeah, have never been. <laughs> definitely never been. Yeah. Um, and then they end up um, at the ski resort it's a resort there yeah i guess so yeah. <laughs> um that's what they call it they call it skyline academy resort or the skyline resort eh, well yeah i'm sure there's rooms it's fine oh. <laughs> <laughs> um but they're all wearing matching outfits oh God, they have the yellow jacket no and like they're all Emily wearing the exact has, like, same ski pants yeah she has the headband has with the like the spider web yeah. pattern and they all have the beanies brett also has the this headband with the spider web pattern and then the other guy who i don't know what his I name can't is can't remember his name uh, that might be Aaron. No, that might be Aaron. Yeah, no, yeah. he kind of looks familiar. Mm. Noah Bastion, perhaps. But anyway, we'll he's got the beanie thing. with the yeah with the spider print, and it's kind of yeah. stupid looking, to be honest. Yeah. So, but they all go skiing together. It's almost like their personality is to match each other. Like that's their entire life. So that that is know, their. That is what they do. It's so that you know that they are a clique. They are together. I guess. And you can't be a part of it if you don't look like us. I guess. That means a lot anyway. of things. <laughs> mm-hmm. um, but so basically Johnny's obviously never been before and they can tell he's never been before. And they're like, well, why don't we give you a little helping push? And yeah. they push him down a mountain. They literally like shove him. And I was just like, that is attempted murder. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And they like catch up to him. And then Emily, because Emily's trying to fix her ski or something. And that's why. They yeah. Because her binding is loose. So she's yeah. trying to get a screwdriver. Yeah. Um. And she miraculously catches up with them. 
Yeah, she's just there. suddenly there. She's just there. And she's like, he's out of control. That's what I was thinking. And like, they're like, we tried to stop him. <laughs> like, you really did it. You're like, you started it. <laughs> right? And you know he can't ski. I almost said surf. <laughs> he can know, definitely surf. You know he can't ski. Because he's like, tell me how to stop. And they're like, oh, don't you know? Figure it out. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> yeah. And then he crashes. He crashes <laughs> he like, into the... Into he the... makes it so... He makes it down the hill to back to the ski resort. The Skyline Resort. Yeah. And like the second his skis hit that floor, he like launches Boom, he's through. Gone. And I'm like, that's <laughs> terrifying. He, I probably would have broken a bone if that were me. Right? Yeah. But so then they're all... They're, the guys are laughing. The guys and Emily mm-hmm. are laughing at him. And there's suddenly three more dudes behind them. Yeah. And I'm like, where did they come from? <laughs> I guess like, you're at a ski resort, so like everybody's there. And, I guess. Like everybody's but, like, just laughing. They never. You never see them you walk never up. Never see them walk up. They're just there. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, you needed more just... people to laugh with it. It's kind of yeah. dumb. But so then yeah. he gets. Does he get in trouble? Kind of with his parents. Not that time. Not that I re- no, because he comes home and she's like, because his dad had to work late. And so he gets home and his mom's like, how was your first day of school? Did you make any friends? And he said, yeah, they took me skiing. Oh, yeah, that's and right. And she's like, she's like, how was that? And he's like, oh, rough landing. It's oh, fine. okay, yeah. But it's when his dad gets home and he just kind of sticks his head in and he's like, how was your first day? Yeah. You see? this is Well, he said something about going skiing and he's like, you need to focus on what's important, like that book in front of you. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, it's so sad it, that yeah. his dad just refuses to mm-hmm. let his kid be passionate be, about be something. who he is yeah yeah he's trying to make his kid like him because he i if you watch more of the movie he resents his dad for yeah. being a surfer yeah and he thinks that he it sounds like he feels like he had a bad childhood right but i don't think he did no i think it's perception like, because he wasn't yeah. good at surfing like his dad right. was right and so like but he, he was just, good at like books and school yeah and so that's what he wanted to pursue. And then he saw His that. Dad as dad like, let him do that and be passionate yeah. about something. I'm like, come on now. Yeah. Hippocrate. Yeah. <laughs> that comes but in it, at it the just, end. It though. just made me, it yeah. just made me hurt a little bit. It made me sad. Yeah. And then, yeah. then later on at the school, like he, Johnny shows up to school and he's like, got the new, he's got the uniform now, but instead of wearing the like blue yeah. shirt and the sweater vest, he's yeah. wearing a Hawaiian shirt with a tie and then the jacket. Yeah. Which I think it looks fine. It's still yeah. red. It is still like, red. <laughs> but he gets in trouble and he gets sent to the headmaster's office, mm-hmm. but he basically is under the impression he's going to the principal's office. And then as yeah. he's approaching, who else comes out but Xenon? <laughs> <laughs> and Xenon, he's like, what did you do? And Xenon's like, mm, She's like, what? what? Oh, he's my oh, dad. D- that's just my and dad. And he's like, the principal's your dad? He's like, well, we call him headmaster here. And I don't yeah. know. I'm, I've been doing a lot of Harry Potter reading and watching recently. So they yeah. said headmaster. And I'm like, her dad is Dumbledore. <laughs> her dad is Dumbledore. And then, and then we meet him. And I'm like, yeah. mm, <laughs> not so much Dumbledore. <laughs> Maybe mm. Dolores Umbridge. But right. <laughs> <laughs> briefly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's so funny. Uh, but anyway. He's just like, don't. He's like, just yeah, he's wear the uniform, like, that's just, it. Yeah, just wear the have uniform, a good we're day. fine. As, lo- as long as I don't have to tell you to wear the uniform correctly again, I don't have a problem with you. You're and good. honestly, I think yeah. that's fair. That's fair, yeah. Like, obviously, he knew there was a uniform, mm-hmm. and he knew he probably should wear it right. Yeah. But, like, you're like, I can't, you just, you're like, we'll warn you once about this. If I have to tell you again, I'm going to get the belt. That's, but, that's, <laughs> <laughs> that's, when, we, that's when we will uh, have a serious talk. Yeah. yeah. And so then it's after school, I think, or is it before school the next day when they're on the bus? I think it's, it's before school a, it's the next day. It's after school the next day. Well, whatever it is. But did you notice what I noticed aside from looking at my note and seeing what I noticed? No, I, di- I didn't notice that. Okay. The bus is cruising along like a snowy cliffside mm-hmm. and the bus doors are just open. <laughs> I didn't notice <laughs> the that. The whole time. I, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, that seems unsafe because this is definitely clearly You're like on everyone mountain. on the bus is a kid, right? Yeah. It's, it's a school transport. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so like... like this seems wrong. I don't think... Maybe the doors are just, like, really clear. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I'll have nah. to watch it again. I don't know. I I'll don't point know. it out to yeah. you. They were open. <laughs> um, but so then he gets introduced to Sam. Mm-hmm. And they have this, like, awkward, like, high five thing. And then Johnny <laughs> yeah, goes like... for a fist bump. And Sam does it. And I'm like, that was, that was like, accidentally oh. left in. And he got left hanging. But there. you know what? It works. Like... Yeah. You know, whatever. Well, so th- yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. So then basically he gets, yeah. um, 
He decides he wants to learn how to snowboard, and he mm-hmm. does, and he has Sam teach him. Yeah. And then you can read my next note because I'm talking um. a lot. <laughs> or read it and then read it in your own words or oh, yeah. have you okay. want to handle it because it made yeah. me kind of annoyed. <laughs> so I'm going to go back just a touch to go back bring too up, far. Just to bring up Randy in the whole. So um, when he goes to learn how to snowboard, oh. um, Sam's like, hey, this is my friend Johnny. Co- uh, and he's like, Kapahala. And he's like, cool, cool. Right. He's like, he's like, oh, aloha, my dude. And he's like, there's a Johnny Kapahala that they call Johnny Tsunami. <laughs> yeah, he's like, they still. He's call like, him they that. still call him that. That's my grandpa. And he's like, dude, you can have anything you want on me. <laughs> and he gets like the snowboard. He gets a new hat. He gets all the gear. The boots. The yeah, boots, everything. All the gear. And I was like, Randy's a dude. Right. Like, what is what a G? He's such but it's a good also dude. like. This man is like, yeah. hey, this, this is my friend from Hawaii. His name's Johnny Kapahala. Hey, yeah. there's a Johnny Kapahala in Hawaii. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Connect like, the dots, bro. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, so then he's like, because Johnny's like, I don't, because it's supposed to be, they call him Skyla, the skies and the urchins. I don't know hey. why they call them urchins, but. Because they're public school and the preppy kids are jerks. <laughs> Valid. So. John even makes a comment about it where he's like, "Oh, I got, I guess they got the the dead end of the stick or something like that." Yeah. In naming, um, but the skies are the skiers and the urchins are the snowboarders, and they shouldn't collide. So they they so, stick on separate sides of the mountain. Yeah, sharks and jets, if you will. Kind yeah. of. Kind of. Except so. not as aggressive. Not, not as aggressive. <laughs> Nobody gets like, shot in the end here. <laughs> no, but <laughs> listen. <laughs> Some people understand sharks and jets. Yeah. As like a comparison. I mean, yes. Anyway. <laughs> so the, so he has the snowboard and they start learning. And then he's like, cool. Thanks, Sam, for teaching me, starting me on learning how to snowboard. Thanks for learning me to snowboard. <laughs> learning brother. me to snowboard. <laughs> and then like they cut to the next scene and he's like at a shop. St- I don't know where he's just walking back to the bus stop probably. Yeah, I think so. Um, And it's brett and his crew and they're like making fun of him for being a snowboarder Mm -hmm. blah 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 and then his dad pulls up and he's like he's like hey you want to ride and he's like cool cool and he just just throws the snowboard like his dad rolls down the window and he throws his dad rolled down the window (laughs) yeah there's like drops the snowboard in the back seat and it's fine yeah it's like his dad knew he went skiing that one day right and and he flipped out about it yeah because he's like you need to focus on school and now he has a snowboard and he's just fine with it he's like cool cool until now you have a snowboard i'll get we'll get to that but (laughs) (laughs) yeah no this next part here (laughs) um we're kind of skipping a lot but basically um johnny ends up learning how to snowboard from sam Mm -hmm. and he kind of starts taunting um emily a little bit definitely teasing her because he like wants her to he really honestly wants her to go but he's like yeah Yeah. it's too hard i don't think you could so she ends up showing up Mm -hmm. to his next session with sam and she's like i bet you i can learn let's do this and yeah. so then they start learning and then she gets kind of cocky and very they're honestly. literally okay i'm like why are we even on this trail because they're on yeah. what looks like a road yeah where there is a sheer cliff mm-hmm. on one side and yeah. she is very close to that cliff and she's like better yeah. beat you to the bottom and yeah. then of course because of things happening and plot development and moving things forward she falls off she falls she, off like, a cliff <laughs> instantly like instantly I'll be- beat you to the bottom. You sure yep. will. Yep. <laughs> right off the cliff. Yes, you will. <laughs> also beat me to heaven. Like, she tumbles so far. I don't literally, know how they catch up to her that fast. Honestly, in watching it, I literally was like watching it. I'm like, oh, she did. She she did. She did. She I don't know her, how you survived that. She broke that. her arm. She broke her leg. She broke her neck. She did. But shout out to that very convenient rock to just grab onto. <laughs> boom perfect perfect grip perfect grip and so then sam's like we got to get her help oh no sam falls down the cliff too he's like we're gonna get you falls (laughs) (laughs) and then he slides down the mountain boom 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 like oh he did too like yeah and then i checked i went back there was no rocks was to no her right. There was no rock to her right. <laughs> and he falls he down the mountain and suddenly, boom. Snow. He just grips the snow real good. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. With his <laughs> Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he grips the rock really hard. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> and so, yes, kids, kid friendly, kid yeah. friendly. Kid yeah. friendly. <laughs> and then he's like, he's like, you got to go find help. 
good, yeah, good go luck, get his Johnny. help. And then she's like, are you sure he's good enough to get to the bottom? He's like, yeah. Yeah, he's good enough to get there. And then the, the whole montage of him snowboarding to the bottom mm-hmm. of the mountain is basically just tumbling over. But like very smoothly, but smoothly. <laughs> where he'll like roll over. Jump. Yeah, then he flies yeah. and he's fine from there. Yeah. But like he's always tumbling, like rolling over his head, but A then bit, landing yeah. back on the board and he's just going. And I'm like that. Yeah. yeah pretty smooth. Honestly, buddy. Not bad. Not yeah. bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. And then uh, then he gets up and then he goes yeah. and gets this snowmobile um, ski the patrol. Ski patrol. Yeah. And then they go save their lives with a rope. <laughs> can I just throw this out and you can correct me if I'm wrong or help me figure this out sure. when he chucks the rope over is it or is it not still wound up well it probably was and then when it lands it's literally just lands right next to them fully untangled well yeah but that makes sense to me anyway you would have it wound up no and you but would it's, hold so on it's to... like the circle uh-huh. and then like wrapped around well yeah like it looks the, like it's still tied together. there is a knot that's designed like that that'll hold it okay. together under light like it'll it'll stay that way as long okay. as there's not a lot of tension on it but as soon as you like throw it throw it'll it. unravel okay. itself okay i think it just looked funny to me because it looked like he was throwing a life preserver and then it was a rope it's also <laughs> possible that that's the thing and i'm just making i'm being devil's advocate here i don't know yeah. i don't know <laughs> but i'm pretty sure that that's a thing where they would have it they, yeah. they can have it tied up and it so it looks secure but then mm-hmm. if you need to throw it you can just, you just chuck do it. it okay or a particular tension on you put on it. Just mm-hmm. bloop, bloop. Anyway, yeah. like yeah. a load bearing wires from Phineas and Ferb. <laughs> yeah. uh, anyway, yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't remember why I wrote loving father here. Does that mean anything to you? Um, Possibly because like they first of all, they all get in trouble for her falling down the mountain. Right. And I'm like, how are they in trouble for snowboarding and her being dumb? Right. Why are they all in trouble? That was literally no one's fault but hers. Like she's the one who who went ahead of them and like i don't know i don't get it she was was, being cocky and i'm like that's no one's fault but hers she's like no dad i'm fine i promise i'm fine yeah like i don't know what father i was talking about because i know it wasn't pete pete is like i I think it's um sam's dad because he's like yes yes that's right because that's when they go to sam's house it's right before that. Yeah. Right before he's they like, go to Sam's house. Because they're all picking them up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And he's like, you could have been seriously hurt. And he's like, I'm sorry, Dad. I was just trying to help Emily. And he's like, well, like, I guess proud. in a way I should I'm be proud, proud of you. I'm proud because you were trying to help you were trying to help. And like, because yeah. he's that military man. He's like, I'm being proud honorable. of you for being Good honorable. Work. Yeah. Yeah. And then. And then in complete. One like 180 of that is yeah. johnny's dad who's basically just pissed at him because yeah. he's like do you know why we're mad and he's like because we could have got hurt and your job is in jeopardy and blah, blah. and he's like that hadn't crossed my mind until now and i was like bro for real i'm like whoa hey like, what were you down. mad about if it like, wasn't your safe your kid's safety and his, <laughs> and his mom job. like jumped in and she's like you could have been seriously hurt and we're glad you're not right <laughs> Like, I love his mom so much. Yeah. I want to be her when I grow up, yeah. obviously. Yeah. His mom was was the real yeah. G at the end here. Yeah. But then at the next day at school, Emily's all like being, she's being very push offy yeah. to him and like being very rude to mm-hmm. Johnny because her dad yelled at her, yeah. basically. And it's like, you're literally deflecting John, J- the blame onto Johnny. Yeah. Like he like, pushed you off the cliff. Right. And like he went into the print, he went into his office and he talked to him and then he's like, Hey, I talked to your dad and she's like, Why'd you do that? You're gonna make everything worse. Right. And he's like and Apparently it did. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I wanna know. How did that make it worse? But yeah. apparently it did. So <laughs> I think the reason her dad was mad at her is because of the whole you're not supposed to be snowboarding, you should be skiing. I guess. Kind yeah. of thing. But I don't understand why everybody's mad. I don't either. It doesn't make <laughs> like, sense. It's fine. But but yeah, yeah, so the next day they're going snowboarding again, you know, because mm-hmm. we're going snowboarding always. <laughs> always. <laughs> and like basically the the snowboarders are like, Johnny, like you save people's lives. You're our leader yeah. now. Well, they saw they saw him do that big jump and they're like, whoa, did he yeah, just Yeah, but that's all it? they saw. <laughs> and they're like, he's the coolest person ever. <laughs> did they see the five minutes before that when he was basically just tumbling down the mountain? <laughs> <laughs> no. No, and then they, they all didn't. just follow him, and I'm like, they're like, yeah, you're but the... he's also perfect the whole time, and I'm like, this is after that, yeah, this is the well, just, you don't tumble. You know that's how you get perfect at snowboarding. You just you go land, off a big jump, land a big jump, and then you can snowboard for the rest of your life. I'm perfectly. becoming a snowboarder tomorrow. Let's go, or maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, maybe not. Um, yeah. um, but so they go basically go on the wrong side of the mountain. They're mm-hmm. on the ski side, and then yeah. they get in that little fight, which is dumb. Dumb. <laughs> so dumb i'm that 
the fight itself was annoying, but like what yeah. happened after the fight is what really got yeah. to me. Yeah. Um, but what's stupid is the ski patrol comes up and you're like, you guys better get on the other side of the mountain because the ski sneak of snowboards are on yeah. the skier side. And I'm yeah. like, even like, the ski patrol is like, like yeah, let's keep you guys separate. Like, yeah. Why? What's with the segregation? That's, that's crazy. <laughs> uh, anyway. Yeah. So then they're in the principal's office talking about the fight. Yeah. Yeah. And, and what do we give ourselves? Disney? Disney, Disney, what what do you give us in this situation? Yes. Well, okay. The mom believes Johnny. Melanie believes Johnny. I guess that's she's fair. like she's like, you shouldn't be fighting kind of thing. But right. Like his dad is the one who's like the real problem. Yeah, for real. Because he's like, I didn't start it. And his dad literally like he doesn't I don't think he ever has a line where he's like, I don't believe you. Right. But he has that he acts. Re, that facial reaction where he's yeah. like, I don't believe you, shut up, we're going yeah. home. Yeah. And like the headmaster is like, he's like, well, I can only believe what the other students tell me. Why can't you believe what Johnny like, tells you? Johnny's he's a student one of your too. students. <laughs> like, what? But then he what? also says, so there was three people there, right? It was, it was, well, three skiers there. Mm-hmm. Emily, Brett, and who we're assuming was Aaron, but yeah. I can't remember. And the other guy. Those three. Yeah. Okay. The, and then there's all the, the snowboarders, which don't really matter except for Johnny. Yeah. So we know that. Brett 100% lied and said that, oh, that yeah. Johnny started it. Yeah. We're assuming Aaron also said that he started it. I mean, he's his follower, so yeah. And then we know Johnny said that Brett started it. Mm-hmm. And he said, did you talk to Emily? What did Emily say? And he says, it doesn't matter. And yeah. I'm like, so that means so that Emily, me Emily probably also, also told you. True. So you now you have started. two on two. <laughs> yeah. But by yeah. taking her out of it, then yeah. you're left with two on one. Left. Yeah. And so then you have majority so. rules and then... You're lying to everyone. Yeah. Yeah. So. <laughs> that was a tangent. But anyway. <laughs> it's all good. I needed to explain that because that yeah. really made me mad. That moment there made me mad. And then his yeah. dad not believing him made me mad. Yeah. And like, um, yeah. Okay. Oh, I said skiing, but I meant snowboarding. Because earlier I'm like. I'm like, I like how he just throws a snowboard in the back and his dad's just fine with it. Even yeah. though he's been trying to get him to stop ski, stop. snowboard, like, surfing. Like he wants him to focus on his studies instead of doing other things. Yeah. Because he wants him to do, he wants to follow, he wants Johnny to follow him. Yeah. In the academics. Because he even makes a comment where he's like, oh, man, I wish I could go to a school like this when I was your age. Right. <laughs> and Johnny was like, cool, dad. Like, I, I don't want to go to a school like this. <laughs> do you want to trade places? We could trade. Right. If you want. So his dad's totally fine with the snowboarding thing yeah. until this moment. Until this moment. Yeah. Then suddenly snowboarding yeah. is just as bad as surfing. Yeah. And it's, I'm like, oh, give me a yeah. break. <laughs> yeah. um, like, why is it only when it's convenient for you to be upset about something? Right. Yeah. But. Yeah. And then this part makes me sad and like he gets he gets home from school that day or that meeting, I guess. Yeah. And Sam's at his front door and he's like, Hey, I gotta talk to you. Right. And they're like his dad's like, You'll have to come back later, blah blah blah. And and his mom's like, We'll give you five minutes. Like, let the kids talk, right. dude. It's been a rough day for Johnny. For real. Why can't you see this? And so he's like that's when Sam tells Johnny that his dad's getting promoted and they're moving to Iceland. Iceland. Which yeah. he seems scared about, but I'm like, bro, it's it's not icy. <laughs> it's I don't think it's cuz he's cuz he makes a calm Okay. This is way back when he first meets him and he says, "I haven't lived anywhere that doesn't have ice ice gla- or glacier or oh, something yeah, that's right. in the name or something like that." And or that's not snow. Right. Um and so when he's like Iceland, he like right. emphasizes the ice with that because he's but- He'll be fine. <laughs> He'll be fine. Iceland's the green one. Yes. <laughs> Fun fact. Those Vikings. <laughs> they, they switched the names to trick people. <laughs> and it worked forever. It did work for a long time. Until we got the internet, I think, yeah. honestly. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> Probably how long it lasted. <laughs> yeah. TBH. So then we have um, Johnny gets into a fight with his dad. And then he calls up Sam. And he says, I can't remember. I think he like, says, how cold are you? How cold are you really? Or something like that, yeah. Yeah. Or like, whatever. And then the next scene is um, them, uh, Melanie and Pete. And she's like, come look at this. And he, he left, left a, a note, note on, on the computer, laptop. which is so adorable. I was like, that's... Although it does, it is a very it good makes... showing of the class separation yeah. here because Johnny yeah. left a note on his, on laptop. his laptop and then Sam leaves hand like a handwritten hand note. note. Yeah. And it looked like it was in cursive, honestly. Probably. 
and i was like wow the 90s when kids actually knew how to write in cursive yeah Yeah, i can kind of do it but i am out of practice because nobody does it anymore like it's not necessary i can but it looks like what i struggle with someone learning it (laughs) so yeah it looks like someone learning how to do cursive yeah what a lot of mine looks like um but anywho his his dad's like well where could they be and he's I'm like, like they're two 13 year olds with no money yeah. how, far how far could, could they, they possibly, possibly get, get? <laughs> <laughs> spoiler <laughs> alert pretty <laughs> damn far <laughs> they can get to hawaii actually um well yeah so they got to hawaii and i'm like how yeah, did they yeah. do that well and they then as soon as it. they revealed the answer i was like i i remember it, hearing that mm-hmm. comment and putting that in the back of my brain yeah. being like that's gonna be important yeah. later yeah because because <laughs> isn't it sam's dad who says it He's like, you gotta admit. Uh, maybe. I think oh, he it said is. it is pretty in, in, in ingenious. No, or... it's it's uh, Johnny. It's uh, Grandpa, who says that. Oh it's yeah, pretty yeah. In, 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 it's when, not it's intuitive. Like the next what is, day word does he's on he say? What word does he use? I don't know. <laughs> Inventive or something like that. He yeah. basically is like, that's a pretty smart thing to do. Like <laughs> he's like, actually, snuck onto sneaking a, onto a military yeah. aircraft is not a creative it's thing not to a do. Not creative thing. I've to played do. GTA Five enough to know that'll <laughs> get some bullets in you real fast. Yeah. But, but like, but maybe, maybe Sam like used his dad, where he's like, I don't know. Who's dad? Any, no, like any he situation, just like mentioned. I don't know. He's, I don't know he's the like, military. yeah. By like, the way, my he's dad. Like, oh, my dad's a first you know, sergeant. Sergeant Sterling. Uh, he said that I can ride this plane to, to Hawaii. <laughs> to Hawaii. Um, There's a lot yeah. of things that have to happen for them to yeah. to to make that happen. Maybe you know? they didn't it's sneak the military. on. Maybe, maybe he took his dad's credit card. I don't know. Yeah, but it's a military aircraft. They don't exactly sell tickets for him. <laughs> but if you're military, you'd have to show your ID. Your he military looks like ID. his dad. He doesn't look enough like his dad. <laughs> He's like nine feet too short. <laughs> And anyway, looks like he needs to bench press another 1,700 pounds. This is what I have to tell my students all the time. Suspension of disbelief sometimes has to happen um, to make something work. Yes, yes. Suspension of disbelief does need to be a thing. However, we are venturing outside of that possibility, in my opinion. <laughs> it's no longer the suspension of disbelief. It is the suspension of... Probability. Probability. The suspension <laughs> of logic the suspension of i guess uh faith in the it's united states government <laughs> 1999 i understand not having faith in the united states government but faith in the united states military in 1999 yeah 2025 maybe but <laughs> this is also before 9 11 so like it could have been easier to just i doubt sneak it on. not in the military i don't think I don't know. because they also have to know which plane is going to hawaii that's true that was the biggest thing for me. Is like, there's no way you were able to be like, uh, yeah, that one's going to Hawaii uh, because it's pointed that direction. <laughs> that one's going to Hawaii because it's got a, it's got a. Um, they just have a big on hibiscus <laughs> on the tail, and the military's like, ah, well, we're gonna hide this airplane. <laughs> wink, wink. But then when it's in Hawaii, you would have to have like a Vermont flag or something on it. <laughs> I don't know. They're a just ski giant slope. stickers. They can <laughs> just <laughs> magnets. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> Those would be gone the second you, you hit the air. <laughs> Rotation <laughs> and the magnets are gone. <laughs> uh, anyway, oh okay, I've spent enough time uh, on that, and I yeah. digress. Yes. Where are we? Um, communication. Oh, yeah. So, like, basically, like, we get to the end. Like, when we get towards the end of any Disney movie, it's always, like, so much of this could have mm-hmm. been solved with just some communication. Yeah. And usually it's between the protagonist and their parents or one yeah. of their parents. Yeah. This time I was like, okay, the the failure of communication here was actually between the mom and the dad. Mm-hmm. Because she could clearly tell Yeah. All of basically everything that Johnny was feeling. Yeah. He, and and like with the move and like how he wanted to surf and his dad didn't support yeah. it. And yeah. she just kind of sat silently and kind of watched it happen. Mm-hmm. And it's like I guess, like, unfortunately, yeah. in the 90s, it was probably pretty normal. Normal and for, common. For the wife or the, the woman to kind mm-hmm. of just let dad be the ruler of the kingdom. And yeah. She doesn't speak up. Yeah. But then she does. But then she does. And, and I'm proud of her for that. We got, like, yeah. a mini heart to heart. Yeah. Which was fine. Yeah. I don't remember this metaphor. It was the metaphor. Okay, so when when they're in Hawaii, right? Mm -hmm. And Grandpa Johnny is like, I'm not going to force them to go back. Yes. But he's basically like, I'm not going to force them to go back. I'm going to make them want to go back. 
Right, yeah. Because that's how you do this. That's how you parent. Reverse psychology. <laughs> yeah. If you tell them to go back, they're never going to. Yeah. If you let them come up on their come up with it on their own, they'll do it. Yeah. And so basically, he's like talking about how Johnny can overcome any wave, mm-hmm. whether it's in Hawaii or in Vancouver, or not Vancouver, <laughs> <laughs> Vermont. Yeah. And he's like, Dad, Grandpa, there are no waves in Vermont, right? Yeah. And then Sam is like, yeah, I've lived there for a few years or a couple of years and I've never seen one. He's like, well, Sam, sometimes a wave doesn't look like a wave. Mm-hmm. And he means like, boom. He's like, okay, now I'm getting into it, guys. Watch this. Boom. <laughs> the wave is you trying to get liked by your peers, not liking the peers that you're going to school with and wanting to expand from that and having Mm -hmm. to deal with the waves of your parents grounding you and your dad moving you away from Hawaii. All these things, like all these challenges are the waves. Are the waves. Yeah. And Johnny Tsunami, Pono, I think that's what he calls him. Yeah. Pono. Pono. Means goodness. Means goodness because he sees the goodness in everything. Yeah. And yeah. Boom. (laughs) Yes. I love it. And and then, and then, um, so they end up flying back the next day, Mm -hmm. but with, with his dad or with, with, yeah, with grandpa Grandpa Johnny. Johnny. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Tsunami. Yeah. And he gets off the plane and they get out of the parking lot and the, then Pete, Johnny, Johnny Kapahala's dad is out there. Yeah. And he gets so upset seeing his father. Yeah. And I said, I wrote he, earlier like, wow, Pete really hates his dad. Yeah. And then this time I was like, man, man Pete really hates, hates his, his dad. dad. Yeah. He was literally like, you could have just put him on the plane. That's all I right. asked you to do. You didn't have to come. Right. And he's like, man, I'm like, dude, what do you now? You're like, not happy to see your dad. What? That's your papa, bro. Yeah, yeah. Gee, I love how I love how Johnny calls him pops. Too. I do too. Like it's not dad, it's not father, it's pops. Pops. I'm like I love that. Which I, yeah. I'm I'm assuming is I don't know. It might be like it might normal. be a Hawaiian. It might be thing, Hawaiian thing. I guess, I'm down yeah. with it though. I dig yeah. it. Um, and then yeah, so then basically, Grandpa Johnny takes takes young Johnny. <laughs> snowboarding and surprise surprise he can snowboard very well yeah. <laughs> which i'm like obviously obviously <laughs> of course yeah. grandpa can yeah. snowboard yeah. why not yeah um and was it yeah. the night before or was it the night this night i think it was this night it was this night so when pete and john yeah when pete and john have their father-son heart-to-heart and i'm like yeah i expected a father-son heart-to-heart this caught me off guard. Yeah. Because I wasn't you expecting, expecting it to be those ones. Pete and yeah. little John. Right. And not, <laughs> and not, not big John not and, his dad. and Pete. Yeah. And I was like, wow, okay. That that was the first thing where I was like, oh. wow, well, okay. Nice yeah. little nice little switch yeah. up on me. And then and then yeah, then grandpa can snowboard. So yeah. that's when he takes him snowboarding. Yeah. Yeah. And then they go when they're going snowboarding, this is that moment that I was talking mm-hmm. about with the cinematography. Okay. Where I was like, because yeah. they're all snowboarding, right? Mm-hmm. And they're coming down this one hill, and the the camera goes to the side, and they're shredding through the snow, and like mm-hmm. a big like off fly, oh, <laughs> whatever you want to call like, it. What's it called? I can't think of the freaking word, but like the snow is like fro- floofing up around them, <laughs> and the way that they shot it, it looks it like starts it to like look a like wave. a wave. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, that is wow, really cool. I nice, do like that one. nice. And it's like That's maybe. A nice touch. Maybe it wasn't the cinematography and it was the editing that might have been a special effect, right. but it looked practical to me. Yeah. And yeah. so I'm assuming mm-hmm. it was, especially well, like, for 90s Disney, it's usually pretty obvious. Pretty, yeah. Yeah. I just wrote it WAV not, there. It did not look <laughs> <laughs> CGI at all. So. Yeah. Yeah. Dude. And then he, I don't remember what happens. I think Sam comes over to say goodbye. Yeah. And they do their awkward handshake yeah, where they literally like, just brush across, across the top the of their chest. chest and then they high they five, do the high five pull like into each other. bro bro grab and then yeah. pull into each other and I'm like yeah. what is the pulling across the chest part doing like that's just you're the, making a cool handshake but like that's if that's the only thing that it. varies from a bro hug then it's really yeah. not <laughs> but he teaches it to him earlier because it's the snowboarder's handshake which again so, why is that the snowboarder's handshake because it's, it's like, different do from something the skies. fun <laughs> add and some like. like uh, there's only so much you can do with giant snow gloves and giant jackets. I guess, but I, I just imagine you could do something more fun. But Probably. It's fine. We'll Miss come up with our own. <laughs> yeah, something like that. You know, whatever. <laughs> Anywho. Yeah. Weird handshake. I liked it. Yeah. <laughs> it's I not like terrible. When, I like when he's teaching Johnny and he's like, he's like, you just pat your shoulder and he goes, oh, other hand. <laughs> right. And I'm like, that was definitely a I'm moment like, that was not supposed to happen, but it worked. So it, I'm it's like, good. You guys... Yeah, that that was a pretty pure moment, I will say. Yeah, yeah. 
And then um, they get back from snowboarding and basically mm-hmm. Johnny is like, yo, so dad, I'm real sorry that I've been kind of a pill lately. And his yeah. dad's like, no, 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 no. It was me He's who like, was the pill. You were fine. You really yeah. weren't doing anything wrong. Yeah. It was just me. But yeah. it's because I was jealous, basically, that yeah. you could, so you that you could surf and got along yeah. with my dad and yeah. I couldn't surf or get along with my dad. Yeah. And I was like, like, oh, there's yeah. the real father yeah. son heart to heart that's yeah. obligatory then, in all of these. <laughs> boom. He's like instantly supportive. And I love, yeah. like, I know it was probably hard for him to like instantly switch and be like, all right, my kid's going to be a snowboarder. Right. That's, we'll let him be a snowboarder. Surfer? Sur- I'm going to let him do his own thing. Right. <laughs> and like, it was probably really hard for him because he was weirdly like about the money. Right. You know, he wanted to be rich and he wanted right. that because he was like, that's, that's why he was it's trying because, to discourage probably because him he didn't get everything he person. wanted as a kid. He's probably yeah. being a little princess to be probably. honest. And that's why it all yeah. started. Yeah. Um, he clearly but, wasn't malnourished or anything because he was alive and not dead. His right. dad was taking care of him. Yeah. So it was fine. Yeah. yeah. Unless his, da- unless he's like upset because like his mom died and he's like upset with his dad being like, if you made more money, you would have been able to pay doctors so that she wouldn't have died. Yeah. Did Maybe that's what it, I don't think so. I don't think so either. If they did, I missed it. I, and I yeah. don't think I did. But yeah. maybe. Yeah. Because like you, even Sam's mom is not in the, she, she, she passed, passed away. away. Yeah. And all he, all he says about it is he's like, yeah, she passed away a few years ago. It's just yeah. me and dad. Right. I think my assumption there was that she was also in the military. Yeah. And she I got, think so. I'm assuming she went on tour and didn't come back. Didn't come back. That was yeah. my assumption, but. Yeah, it could have, have also been a medical thing. I don't know. I don't remember if I can't remember what specifically because pic- he looks at a picture and he's like, oh. she's not wearing like a uniform yeah. or anything, but like I can't. I just want to examine what's around. Sure. It. Sure. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. So while they're snowboarding the day before, because I forgot to mention it, mm-hmm. they decide that they're going to basically they get into it with the with the skiers and they basically decide yeah. that Brett and Johnny are going to race down the mountain mm-hmm. and whoever wins gets to decide how the mountain yeah. is split up. Yeah, because that's what they do in Hawaii. Whoever wins the surfing competition gets the beach for the day. Yeah. And or and they let whoever they want on the beach. Yeah. Kind of thing. Yeah. So he's like, let's do that. We'll race. Whoever wins gets the mountain for the day. Yeah. Except it's like permanent. <laughs> yeah. But so then they go do the race the next day. And like the race was a race. It was a race. There's yeah. a lot of tumbling, a lot of fighting, a lot yeah. of. The yeah. bad guy being like, we'll beat you at the bottom, push so you over much. so you get yeah. off to a bad start. Yeah. Super far behind Johnny, catches up unrealistically fast. Unrealistically fast. And then suddenly they're the yeah. same speed exactly. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. Johnny should have shot past him if he's yeah. this fast. It's very much like um, in Brink. Yeah. The, like, the downhill course. Right. How Brink catches up thing. to yeah. the, uh, what's his name? Mm-hmm. Whatever. <laughs> Catches Val. up to Val super, super quickly, quick. yeah, and then can't pass him. Can't pass him, but he's like, and I'm he's like, like, okay, I made it to here. <sighs> Breathe. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, if we were in race cars, guys, makes sense. Makes sense. Slipstream, you get try to get you get out from behind somebody, mm-hmm. you lose that slipstream, you're not going to go as fast. Yeah, you are a person on a set of rollerblades or on a snowboard. So, there is yeah. not enough slipstream for that to matter. Right. <laughs> Especially yeah. as far back as you were when you started catching up. Yeah. It makes me so mad in, in these <laughs> movies where they like catch up all quick and I'm like, okay, did Johnny slow down when he got there? Right. Or did he start to get past, did Brett start to get passed by Johnny and Brett's like, oh, better go faster. Right. Because <laughs> I mean, why would you not be going full speed the whole time? Yeah. It's a race. It's a race. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Drives me nuts. Yeah. Eh, it's, so then it's whatever. basically Johnny wins. Yeah. Also the winner gets, the gets um, oh, yeah. tsunami, the tsunami medal. Medal. Medallion. Yeah. yeah. Which is super good. I love that. Yeah. Which he I was, think is Johnny what? was supposed to, I think Johnny was supposed to win it mm-hmm. in Hawaii and he probably would have by this point yeah. if they'd stayed in Hawaii. But since they moved, yeah. he's like, oh, I'm going to give this to my grandson yeah. and I have to do and it like, in a way where he wins something. Yeah. And so this is and how like, we're doing it. The, I, that definitely pushed Johnny to be like, yeah. he's like, I know I'm not the best snowboarder, but like, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm going that to win that medallion. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah for sure. And then they, he they he wins and everyone mm-hmm. celebrates and his dad like his dad's like yeah. we're having a big party at our house and everyone's invited everyone's invited and I'm like there That's are like, hundreds of people over That's a here a lot of people and then they go back to the house yeah oh but was it uh, yeah okay so they go back to the house based on daylight you know mm-hmm. not two hours later there's a huge party yeah with a Hawaii theme yep mm-hmm. and I'm like y'all threw that together fast. fast. 
maybe Johnny's birthday's next week. Maybe they had it already and they're like, hey, let's, let's do, do it real quick. Right 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 Might as well. Johnny, you're not going to have a birthday party this week. <laughs> this, this is your birthday Sorry, party. Sorry, this is your actually, birthday party no. this year. Maybe that's what happened. But they threw that party together fast. Yeah. And it bugged me a little bit. Yeah. But I'm like, it's fine. This is where I let the suspension of disbelief take over because I'm like, it's yeah. fine. It's whatever. It's fine. We maybe can have a party they, 12 maybe seconds they had after a it feast happened. Ready. Perhaps. They had that feast ready because that's what they do every night. They have a feast. Maybe. Maybe. And they and said, it's always Hawaii they themed. went, you know what? <laughs> every, every, You're like, yeah, we could feed a small village with the amount of food we cook on a nightly basis. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I guess we don't uh, have to eat all of it tonight. <laughs> yeah. We could share. And then this is um, the brothers. Um, what is his name? Randy and... Randy and Ronnie. And Ronnie. Mm-hmm. Who you've discovered based off of our information here. Yeah. Was played by the same dude. It was played... I don't know how accurate that is, but like... I guess it's very possible. I don't it's think not they... That, re- I think they hug, but like it's easy to swap out for a body double for a oh, hug yeah. like that. Because you don't see the other guy's face. Yeah. yeah you, you only know, see one of their face when they do the yeah. hug, so it must be. It must but be. But it also makes like, sense. I'm like, no... Like kind of cool that's very cool that's i guess i'm into it i don't know when parent trap came out wait parent trap was pr- probably early when, 90s when mid lindsay 90s Lohan, when lindsay lowen yeah. does like that whole thing yeah. so it's not that hard for them to figure yeah. out but i was like True. my well, mind and was, there was my yeah. moan went <laughs> when I, mean, I saw that they've, they've been using like, huh? that camera trick for probably a century oh probably forever yeah but like that was probably one of the earliest things we figured out how to do that that person, that actor. Let me give him credit real quick. Yeah. Steve Von Warmer. Von Warmer. Von Warmer. Von Warmer. Von Warmer. Like, I didn't know it was the same person. Yeah. They didn't even look like they were related. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's I was like, true. So yeah. our information may be wrong, but I'm pretty sure there's not. Ronnie is not credited on IMDb at all. So yeah. like, when you go when you Google it, that's what I grab for our show. Mm-hmm. Um, and then if you go to IMDb, you can see like a. It's the yeah. same list, but it's slightly different. Yeah. And it only lists Ronnie mm-hmm. or Randy as a character. Yeah. And it's it's Steve. Mm-hmm. But it, there's no Ronnie listed on there. Right. So I'm like, it must be this. It so must like, be. Yeah. Because they're both pretty. They're equally yeah. important. You can't like, credit one without the other. Now that I know that information, I'm going to go back and watch and be like, I can see it now. Yeah. But like, at, but, as I was watching, I was like, what? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. But so basically you learn that they run the the ronnie runs the ski shop and randy runs the snowboard shop mm-hmm. right and it's because their parents owned it together the their, resort their as a grandpa whole the grandpa it. owned it as a whole and their parents got divorced. and their parents got divorced and ronnie went to skyline yeah and randy went to it's like maple valley high or something yeah. like that the, yeah the public school the public school and so and then when their grandpa died he left it to them right and then and that's they, when it got divided. They split it down the middle because they're like, and I'm like, oh, we so we get the whole backstory brothers. here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but then they end up making up, and they're like, yeah, the mountains for everyone. Ta-da. Yeah, yeah. It only so took a like, random kid from Hawaii <laughs> beating yeah. a skier. It, yeah. It's fine. <laughs> so you know, uh, it's... but yeah. Then we jumped into the uh, the uh, credit music, mm-hmm. and I was like, this is a this chill is, bop. This is a bop. Yeah. I dig this. Smart House yeah. made me mad, but this is good. <laughs> Only because Smart House overused their yeah. credit music. Yeah. What was the other and one? Like, um, the Thirteenth Year, I think, was the one that I was like. Ugh. Yeah, because it was like it was just like a weird. It was a song written specifically like, for yeah. that, and it was like yeah. a little too on point. <laughs> yeah. With what was happening. Yeah. So. So. Awesome. So, how do you yeah. think this movie held up? Um, most of it is really good. Most of it held up pretty good. I think there so. are a couple of things like. That, um, I'm trying to think of like specific age ones. well. Yeah, it just didn't age well. Well, there was one. Was I like, took it out. I'll mention it yeah. though. But there's this one thing where they're like, "Yeah," I, he's like, "Have you ever seen any any volcanoes explode?" He's like, "Well, there's a couple of volcanoes, but I've never seen one explode." And I'm like, <sighs> "He says erupt." Oh well, yeah, he does say erupt yeah. or whatever. But yeah, and I'm like, yeah. Ugh, "Some people some have people now. have now." Yeah. yeah, that didn't age super great. Yeah. But what was another um, one. Here's. There's probably a lot. There's probably a lot that I just like looked over, but yeah, um, the the segregation of the two, like the preppies versus the public school, like I mean, honestly, like all of these bullying movies, like didn't age well. They, no, <laughs> the bullies don't age well, and like yeah. probably, you know who did age well? 
Brandon Baker. Brandon Baker. Breaker. Breaker. <laughs> Baker. Baker Breaker. <laughs> Baker Breaker. He uh, he aged Baker. very well. Yeah. He looks exactly the same. Yeah. <laughs> this could be this could be an old picture that we have. Oh, actually, too, you know what? It totally is. He's, do you see what's behind him? Yeah. The I Disney do. Channel Disney Games Channel logo. Games. <laughs> yeah. Um, Lee Thompson Young though. That definitely is a newer picture. That is and a newer he picture. Yeah. Aged like fine wine as well. Yeah. Yeah. Kirsten Storm aged okay. Yeah. She anyway, looks we're like not an talking about now. that. <laughs> <laughs> We're not um, talking about that. So it held up. It held up pretty yeah. cool. I, I, think I, it I will watch it up. again. Yeah. yeah. I, I honestly don't know. I'm excited it for four now, years but. from now when we get to do Johnny Coppola back Woo. on board. <laughs> okay. I mentioned in my podcast with Adriana <laughs> last week because I was talking about how me and you were getting ready to do Johnny Tsunami. And I was like, mm -hmm. but in a couple, but we'll get to one later. That's Johnny, Johnny Coppola back on board. And I'm confused how his name goes from Johnny Tsunami to Johnny Coppola. And in but the no. first two minutes of the movie, I'm like, oh, that's oh, because Johnny Tsunami is his grandpa. grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And Johnny Coppola is just his name. Yeah. And I thought it I thought it was yeah. not at first, but now yeah. I feel dumb. But yeah. sorry for that last week, guys. Sometimes I say stuff good. in last week's episode <laughs> that I realize is dumb this week's episode. You know, it happens. Even though, spoiler alert for you guys, it is the very next day. That was literally <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> if um, you made it to the end of this yeah. <laughs> this rant. <laughs> yeah, if you made it to the end of this rant. <laughs> It was that was it was the same day as the last one, but leave that a, is because leave I am, a hibiscus in the comments. Yeah, leave a hibiscus in the comments if you listen to that <laughs> rant there. Um, I am currently when this comes out, I will have just got back from my one day trip to the magical, most magical place on earth. Yeah. Um, and as as that uh, you know, because we we normally record on Wednesdays. Mm -hmm. and um i will be in the parks <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, on wednesday next week so we Our had to normal scheduled yeah, we had to jump in a little early yeah. but th thankfully the decoms are one where you we could we honestly could just like take a couple if like we had time oh, yeah. we could just take two days off we could record an entire year's worth of episodes in a honestly. day <laughs> and then i just have to set them to release at the right time and that's all yeah. i gotta worry about but anyway maybe in the I future digress. we can figure that out Yes. But, so what would you rate this movie out of five stars? Um, This one, I would give it a four. A four? Four out of five. I give it a four as well. I think yeah. I think there's some moments. Well, I think the biggest reason I don't want to give it a five is because, like I said earlier, like I didn't remember yeah. every moment of this movie yeah. like I did the last four. Right. There were a lot of parts where you were like, oh, yeah, that was this movie. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. And it's like, oh, that's right. Oh, I did, yeah, Kirsten yeah. Storm's in this. Oh, yeah. 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 I did recall this movie like really well, but it was like, it was like, oh, that was this movie, not like a different decom. Right. Because like, I think I mixed this one and the second one up. Oh, okay. That makes sense. A few times. Sure. Even though I know he's older in the second one because it's like right. six years. But barely because he's like, well, it is a lot longer later. Yeah. But like he barely aged in between. So yeah. So. yeah. But yeah, well, right on. Yeah, I, see, I, yeah. I stick with that with four yeah. four stars. Eventually, we're going to have a website and we'll have All this our list. tier list for the parks laid out yeah. and we'll have our ratings for, mm -hmm. for these laid out. Yeah. But we don't have that yet. Not so yet, it's, but it's, it's, it's in the future. Yeah, it's it's coming. We'll have um, it eventually. Yeah. So, um, for now guys, that's all we got. Mm -hmm. And, um, I hope you enjoyed listening. If you're listening, we are available on all major podcast platforms, including Spotify, Apple podcasts, um, uh, <laughs> Amazon podcasts <laughs> and, um, I heart podcasts. So you can yes. find us on there. If you're watching, if you are, um, strictly listening, you can watch a video version on YouTube where I unfortunately have to tell you right now <laughs> that one of our cameras failed. So we only have yes. two angles instead of the typical three yeah. that we've had strong for probably like four months. Yeah. You're going to see the side of my face a lot. Yeah. Sorry. sorry. <laughs> Anytime Marcy's talking, we got, we got the two shots. So sorry about that. Um, we've got things in the works to fix that. Hopefully by mm -hmm. next podcast we'll have that sorted out um and then um yeah youtube you can find us on youtube <laughs> by going to youtube.com forward slash at noah parker underscore channel or typing in the search bar noah parker underscore channel uh, make sure it's the one that's the blue circle just says the noah parker channel in it um mm -hmm. if it's a photo of a dude it ain't me <laughs> it's not um mm -hmm. And you can also follow the podcast on Instagram and TikTok by going to either of those websites or searching um, in the uh, searches for those apps. <laughs> Gosh, <laughs> my words are all over the place. Searching, um, in, searching the in the apps. Um, at, Noah, at Noah Parker's World of Wonder. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, yeah, make sure you guys leave a like rating, whether you're listening or watching. 
and subscribe or follow depending on what the platform you're enjoying us on um it calls it um <laughs> and um next week what are we doing um i think we have a tbd for next week's podcast um because i will be fresh back and i won't really know what's going on <laughs> um That's but we will have something we'll have something yeah and until then guys let the wonder take hold Thank you.